AITA for not forgiving my mother-in-law for ruining our wedding. My partner and I got married last Saturday and his mom end up making him cry on his wedding day because of her sulking, not speaking to us, and general demeanor on the day. He was visibly upset throughout the day and it ruined our wedding. Firstly his family were late on the Friday, said they'd be there at 1 arrived at 5 p.m., they also forget the steamer the one thing I asked them not to forget. In the morning of the wedding my mother-in-law informs the groom, my partner, that the Polaroid camera we were going to use is out of battery, an hour after she says she is setting up to drop it ten minutes down the road. At this point he is going to be late for first look pictures, so after she suggests he buy a new camera in town, he snaps at her to leave it and communicate better and sooner next time. I also have an encounter with my mother-in-law in the morning when she pops round to pick up flowers. No comment of how am I feeling, makeup looks nice etc. She just asks me to change the seating plan so his uncle can be on a different table. I inform her I can't deal with that right now as it's the wedding day and to speak to her son. Probably a bit abruptly. We arrive for our wedding super happy then as we sit up to sign the papers in the ceremony I clock her. So miserable not making any eye contact. She's a witness comes up scribbles a signature says, congratulations, in a huff sits down again. My mum is stood there shocked whilst she signs the other signature. No photos were had of this due to how quick she was to get it done. After the ceremony she sits sulking in the garden. My partner is visibly upset and doesn't know why she's upset, asks her if she's okay she says she's fine. The meal was the most uncomfortable thing, she walks around the room until she has to sit down on the top table with us at the last minute. Makes comment about the food, oh guess I'll be veggie as it won't be halal, despite us making sure all the food was halal and saying in advance. Asking why she is sat next to the groom and not his dad. Not speaking to my parents, not smiling in any photos. She leaves about 10 p.m. after not dancing, barely chatting to guests. The next day when we ask what on earth happened and why she made her son cry on his wedding day, he went off to the bathroom during the meal to cry cause he felt so sad. She claims we both shouted at her in the morning and we ruined her day. Lots of back and forth arguing and screaming from her part. She didn't understand what she did wrong said she didn't sulk and wasn't rude. I told her the behavior was embarrassing. Eventually she briefly finally apologizes a couple hours later for upsetting us. Am I wrong for still not wanting to speak slash see her again? I just can't forgive how she made us both feel. The fact all my friends clocked it and my family felt bad thinking they did something wrong. I just don't want to make it uncomfortable for my partner who has forgiven her.